Eyes of the law, George Zimmerman, now a free man, but death threats continue to pour in. Just how free is this guy now? With me, former NYPD detective, personal security expert Harry Howe. All right, Harry, how are you? Good, Judge. All right, good. I want to put up a screen here, a full screen. Uh, there is a guy by the name of Victor Cruz. You may have heard of him. He yes. is a wide receiver with the Giants. He tweeted, Zimmerman doesn't last a year before the hood catches up with him. And, of course, then he pulled back. I guess he started apologizing, whatever. And I love this. I'm a Giant fan. Good. Enough of that. <laughs> now, uh, is there truth to that? It's a possibility. You don't really see this happening at all. You know, right now, unfortunately, it's not over for Zimmerman right now. All right, we've got the uh, we've got the uh, civil rights violation that they're going to be looking at. The NAACP is going to try and keep this thing in the news uh, until something like that happens. So Zimmerman's going to probably have to take some steps to make sure like what? that nothing happens. Well, he's going to. I guess what he had to do is he's got to talk to his attorneys and say, listen, do you think I should stay? Still pretty close in Florida, all right? Maybe, maybe not. You know, I, I would, I would tend to say that he should take a vacation if he can for a while, all right, and then come back and then decide maybe he shouldn't stay in the same neighborhood for a while. You know, should stay out there for about a month. Although he's finally, you know, he's going to get his gun permit back. But you know what? It doesn't matter. First of all, why would this guy take his gun back after the trouble it brought him? And I'm a gun owner, and I have lots of guns. Why not? Wouldn't you? I mean, if if, if you defended yourself. All right, and you use that weapon, which is the reason you why you have that to law, I got to tell you, okay. Harry, that law's a tough law. I mean, the kid had Skittles and iced tea. You know it. Oh, come on, Judge. No, no, come on. The kid wasn't out looking for yeah, trouble. Yeah, but the, 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 fact, the fact was that he attacked Zimmerman, all right? You know what? Had him down the That's ground. That's a problem with stand your ground. Only, you know what? Only Zimmerman's here to tell us. But back well, to we you. Well, we're going to look at the evidence anyway. Yeah. You know? We look at the evidence and it all. So what, what does he do? Does he wear a bulletproof vest? What does he do? I wouldn't say so. I mean, you know, you see on TV, though, Always coming after people like this, but in real life, you don't really see people. Kind of, I mean, is there anybody out there planning right now to go after Mr. Zimmerman? Probably not. You know, but you got to be worried about that one lunatic. You know, and you, and you got to be worried. You know, on a regular case, somebody go on vacation, they come home, all right, everybody forget about it. People forgot about 9/11 a year after it happened. Let me ask you a question. You're a tough guy, right? You're an NYPD detective. Mm -hmm. uh, you've had a lot of fights in your life. Sure. You duke it out, fist fights, you know, you take your lumps, and you yes. win or you lose, you go home, you ice your bruises, call it a day. Sure. Even if you had a gun, you wouldn't necessarily take it out. I mean, don't no. tough guys just fight it out? It, you know, it, it, it depends on what, what you're dealing with. You know, if he felt his life was in danger, you're getting your head. Remember, you know, he got hit in the, in the schnoz the first time, right? That will stun you. It happened to my partner. He got totally stunned. He got his nose broken. I know a lot of guys who got hit in the schnoz. They don't take a gun out and kill someone. No, I, I mean, I, I, I never did that either. But, you know, he was a soft guy. Remember what the uh, expert said? That's He's right. Harry Ho, thanks for being with us. And that's it for us tonight. Thanks for joining us. And remember to